How to fix error 0x800706D9 when opening Windows Sandbox on Windows 10. Note, the following tips may apply to work PC only. 1. Turn on Windows Firewall. Note, get your system administrator to test it. And, try enabling Windows Firewall if it is disabled. For Windows 10 1903 Sandbox won't start errors, all you do is just restart the following service under Administrative Tools, Container Manager Services. Then, reopen Sandbox. If it does not start up do the following below. If you have Hyper-V installed and Virtual Disk is turned on under Administrative Tools you must restart all these services, Container Manager Services, 8. Host, Virtual Disk, Hyper-V Virtual Machine Manager, Hyper-V Host Compute Service, Network Virtualization Service. Do this in the following order, right-click over Network Virtualization Service click Restart and Wait, right-click over Virtual Disk click Restart and Wait, right-click over Hyper-V Virtual Machine Manager click Restart and Wait, right-click over, Hyper-V Host Compute Service, click Restart and Wait, right-click over, Container Manager Services, click Restart and Wait, you may refer to the following IMG, check these services are still on, Application Guard Container Service, if installed. Remote Procedure Call, RDC, this must be running as most of the others rely upon its function it should never be disabled. Note, once they are checked start sandbox and it should open up if it does restart your computer to ensure the services are still functional or a restart of computer this should also be done if sandbox does not start up once the aforementioned services are restarted and checked.